Welcome back, everybody. Um, I noticed that the music was a little, a titch loud in the last few videos we had. So I turned down the MIDI just a tiny bit. You should still be able to hear it very well, though. East Tower. Looks like there's a basement and a way up from here. We've got those. We've got those. Again. Cameo. Yep. Get out of the way. And nothing down here but experience points. Can you see? Can you search those papers? No, you cannot. Yeah, you can't search them. Well, it's good for experience at least. King Burlock, you're back already, huh? More adventurers charge you with the quest of finding the Six of Mirror. Oh no, wait, King Burlock. Yeah, King Burlock was there originally, so. Um, give me a second to pause it. I need to take a look at the manual and get a refresher on the storyline. Okay, and pause. All right. Um, I'll go away. Hang on one second. Are we recording? Yes, we are. All right. Um. Oh, jeez. Sorry about that. Hyper. Oh man, what's it doing? Go away. Yes. There we go. Okay. Ah, no. Sorry, I'm having a bit of trouble working with everything, and... Ugh. No! I see that you're recording. Yes, go away. Sorry about that. It's just giving me a little bit of trouble here. No, no, this is the window. Okay, good. Yes, good. Everything's good. No. Ugh. Sorry, I'm just... Now I'm just half tempted to look at it again, just to make sure I'm not screwing things up. No, no, everything's good. Sorry. Um, just got bogged down in all the controls and everything. Okay, after reading it... Jeez, calm down, King Block. Um, well, as you can see, the king is very interested in finding a sixth mirror. And it's not King Burlock that is being influenced by Zine, it is actually Roland himself who is Zine, and Lord, Lord Burlock, King Burlock, is just, he's infatuated with getting the Sixth Mirror for some reason, whether it be with mental manipulation or whatever, we don't know. Anyways, books, yes, we need these books, have everybody read them, we have no reason for everybody inside the entire game to not become an astronomer, and all we always need to do is pick up the book and look at it. So, and everybody's a linguist now, too. Just to make sure that everybody's a linguist and an astronomer. Linguist, astrologer, linguist, astrologer. This game's awfully liberal with handing out skills. You normally have to pay an arm and a leg for them. I'm not sure if it has any real advantages, but usually in society games like this, it's better to have than not have. Throne. Um, save our game and turn on clairvoyance. I have not had a good track record with thrones, let me tell you.
right, right. Nothing here. As you can see, the king has really gone through a lot of his treasury. Huh. <sighs> well, let's head up top here. Can we open it? Well, I guess we can, but we just turn our character off the process. Power cure yourself back up. There's a treasure chest that has more. Wow, they took out fleet. Oh. Shh. Okay, cast new protection from elements. We are probably going to die from this encounter. like this, we might be able to win this. Oh, jeez. What do we have? Whistle of Deadly Swarms, use that. And did nothing. What a surprise. Not sure what to do here. Cast new frostbite, maybe. Worst is good on him. Energy blast use. No! Seems to be very resistant to some of these spells. No! We almost got him though. Nice. Jeez. Wasn't expecting two at once. No! Fortunately, with the items we have, we were prepared for it. I'm sure Lord Corlock will mind us looting all of his treasure chests, so, haha. Uh -huh. Besides, he has a lot of gold. Alright, let's rest up right here. Alright, uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to wait until we level up just a tiny bit more in order to be able to sack that treasure chest because we relied heavily on consumable items. We should not be doing that. What the heck? Oh, jeez. That's looking very bad. No idea they come out to try and kill us down here, too. 